What's up, Cal gang? All right, so we got this uh, physics problem here. So it says that we're on Mars, right? And it says that Mars used to have oceans that were half a kilometer deep. And it wants us to find the gauge pressure at the bottom of such an ocean. And then part B wants us to find how far on Earth's ocean would you have to go to experience the same gauge pressure. So let's go ahead and calculate that. So our formula for pressure is equal to density of the liquid times the gravity and then times the height. Um, that's gauge pressure. If you're doing atmosphere, if you're doing a total pressure, you have to add atmospheric pressure to that or whatever is on top. Uh, but we're not going to we're not concerned about that. We're just finding gauge pressure. So we can pretty much have all this stuff, right? So pressure is equal to uh, so the density of water is one thousand. Very convenient. Gravity on Mars three point seven one. Height is five or zero point five kilometers, which is five hundred meters. We need it in meters. Calculate that. Calculate that. <laughs> You're gonna get uh, 1.86 times 10 to the 6 pascals. Pretty good pressure right there. I mean, that's like, I mean, you're half a, I mean, yeah, you're very far underwater. Like, half a kilometer? I mean, I don't know if there's any pools that deep. So even on, even on Mars, it's very heavy. So now it wants us to find what that height would be on Earth. <clears throat> uh, on Earth's ocean. So this is kind of a trick question, and I actually got it wrong when I solved it first, um, because the ocean is salt water, right? Ocean water has a different density than regular water. This says this is fresh water, but on Earth it says it's uh, salt water. So the density of salt water is about one three or one zero three zero, which is about thirty more. It's just a tiny bit more dense than um, than the water on Earth or the water. Uh, that's pure, I guess, deionized water. So we can say that pressure here is equal to density, gravity, height, but this is the gravity of Earth. This is the density of salt water. So we know that the, we're trying to find the same pressure. So 1.86 times 10 to the 6. Why am I doing this? It's ugly, but it's okay. It's equal to 1030 times the Earth, gravity of Earth, 9.81 times the height. So if you want to find this number, what you're going to need to do is take this and divide it by 1,030 and then divide it by 9.81. And you're going to get that the height is equal to 184 meters. There you go. That's uh, pretty far down on Earth, too. Yeah, that's how you solve this kind of problem. Uh, yeah, just nail your formula. So yeah, good luck on your physics homework, guys. Stick around for some more physics. See you guys later.